Welcome to this Windows 10 channel and if you want to have this is a tips and tricks video where you can learn how to add languages to your PC and also even how to change the native language of your Windows 10 operating system and it's all done thanks to the language packs that you can download. The only version of Windows that does not support this is the Windows 10 N version. If you have an N in your Windows 10 version it's a single language version. There's no other language packs you can add to this. But with regular version of Windows 10, Home, Pro, it works with all of them. Simply go to your settings. There you will go to time and language. And then there's region and language. Here you have language packs. You can add a language. So you click that button here and you choose whatever language you want to add to your computer. There's a lot of them. Once you have installed a new language, you will have language packs that you can download for them. So say for example, I want Espanol and I want Espanol from Ecuador. Well, you click here and it's going to add. Here we go. Now it searches Windows updates because each language have language packs. So you go to the options and you see here there's a download button for three things language packs basic typing and handwriting and if you download the language packs it might add even a um, download for speech so download everything once that is done all you have to do is simply click the language pack that you want as a default click set as default and it's going to change to Windows display language so this means this will be your default language from now on it will need and require you to restart your PC of course if you want to remove some languages you just click the remove button next to it the only one you can remove is the one that is actively used at this time so you can remove for example in this case English because it is a Windows display language right now but if you set this as default, then you are able to, if you want, remove other languages. Once you restart, you'll notice that pretty much everything is in French. The only thing you have to understand is that the apps that you've installed might still be in the native languages. So what do you do? Simply uninstall them and re-download them from the Microsoft Store or simply re-download them from the web browser you use to download the program. It will then download and install in the native language you have chosen. So that's as simple as that. And of course, you can switch back and forth between different languages, but still remember that the apps will need to be updated or re-downloaded to match the languages afterwards. But it's a great way to simply have your computer and your favorite language on your PC in Windows 10. You enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching our videos.